block today in this video I'm gonna be changing painting this and this from silver to black using plasti dip check it out Okay, what I'm trying to do is completely black out the bumper. So we're gonna go this cheap solution this time. It's gonna be with Plasti Dip. See what it's all about. I've heard about it. I heard good things, heard bad things, but I'm gonna give it a try. It's only a few dollars. The first thing is to start with cleaning up and prepping. Take the license plate off, cleaning, drying, and then start coating. Clean it really good. You don't want any uh, oil or any residue or any dust on it. So the plastic dip doesn't stick, doesn't glue. I'm specifically only cleaning the gray, the silver area where I want a plastic dip to adhere to. Next thing you want to make sure you want to make sure you dry it really, really well. It has to be completely dry, otherwise the plastic dip will not, uh, glue will not stick onto the plastic. Make sure you get into the nooks and crannies over here, because that's where all the water and moisture is. Mm -hmm. Want to you want to make sure it's completely dry. You can even use a heat gun slightly to evaporate all the liquid, all the all the moisture. Not too close so it don't melt or bend the plastic. Next step will be taping off parts that we don't want covered with the Plasti Dip. It's not important, it's, you don't have to do it, but it makes cleanup uh, easier. Finished taping up all the areas, even behind. So later, later on cleanup will be much easier, hopefully. Okay, gonna start with the first coat now. First coat goes on. A uh, very light coat, and I have to wait 30 minutes between 30 minutes between uh, coats. So I didn't choose the best day because uh, it seems like it's gonna rain. So hopefully I'm gonna be lucky. 30 minutes between coats. I want to get four, five, maybe six. That's quite a few hours. So let's get started. <laughs> So the first coat is on, it's literally just to get it stained, to get the chemical on, to get first the chemical reaction going so it glues on later on with the next coat. I'm gonna wait 30 minutes. You can see I have a lot of spots not touched yet, but just, just getting the spray on, the chemical on. Got it all the way from the bottom, on the sides. So I'll wait 30 minutes and then go with my second coat. I'll be back in 30 minutes. First coat is on. Okay, that was the second second layer. It looks a bit golfy or like liquid here. Hopefully when it dries up, it will solidify and become uniform. Uh, we'll see what it looks like in 30 minutes. I'll be back for the third coat in 30 minutes. This looks better. Still, of course, there's, there's spots that are showing uh, the silver color underneath. 
but third, fourth, fifth coat will definitely do it. It's now 30 minutes after the third coat. It's smooth, it's drying uh, a bit rough. I don't know if uh, it's supposed to be flat or smooth like a mirror, but it definitely isn't. I don't mind it because uh, it gives it some nice roughness to it, but that's just the third, third coat. I'm gonna go with the fourth coat now. started to rain so I had to emergency I had to uh, drive the car into the garage I haven't done that in years in 10 years take all the bikes out and drive the car into the garage so but now it stopped it stopped raining so I'm gonna take it out for the fifth it 30 minutes since the fifth or sixth coat I'm gonna peel off the uh, the blue tape around and let it dry say for four hours they say till you can finally mount the license plate uh, back on It's literally uh, like saran wrap. So after clearing up uh, all the blue tape, I did realize that I taped it a little bit too close to the to the silver. So when I uh, took took out the blue tape some of the tape actually pulled pulled out the plastic dip and exposed the silver uh, uh, so underlying paint so I'm not sure if it was a good idea to tape so close maybe a little bit uh, further out so then when you peel it doesn't pull uh, pull the plastic dip with it anyway I'm touching it up with a few more coats over here exactly where the silver is exposed and here uh, another good idea is uh, what I did later on is I used I used uh, used a knife, a box cutter, just uh, to cut the plastic dip just before I pulled uh, the blue tape off. So all in all, I'm gonna let it wait for a few hours. I think it looks pretty nice. It came out real, really nice for seven dollars the can was and four hours of. Uh, in between like five or six coats it came out really nice so that's it for now see the difference between before and after if you enjoy this video please go ahead and like it share and if you're not subscribed to our channel go ahead and uh, click that black and white uh, Kissel vlogs logo and that way you get notifications anytime I put out a new video out thank you and peace out